Hi, I'm Sushma Sauri with Bentley Technical Support. While working on models using Bentley Hydraulics and Hydrology products, you may be spending extra time re-entering standard information that you use in every model like conduit catalogs, pump definitions, element symbology, etc. Today, I'm going to show you a few features that help you quickly configure and reuse these standards. These features are available for products like Civil Gems, Civil Storm, Watercat, Hammer, etc. I am going to start by showing how to add data to the engineering library and share that engineering library on different computers so that another person doesn't need to recreate it or which you can utilize for another project. For that I need to go to Components, Engineering Libraries. Let's say that I want to add my own engineering library for new sizes of conduits which are not there present in the existing engineering library. For that I need to click on Conduit Catalogs, Create Library. I need to save this XML file somewhere on my computer. I will name it ABC. Now right click on this and say Add Items. Select the shape over here and here you need to add different sizes of conduits for your reference. Once done with the data entry, click OK. Now this engineering library for the conduit catalogs has got created. Here is the path for that engineering library that is .xml file. You can just copy this xml file and send it to your colleagues which they can use for their modeling on their computers. In the same way you can create own engineering libraries for pump definitions, minor losses etc in water gems and hammer as well. Another feature that can be shared among the group is flex tables. You can create the shared flex tables and add fields of your interest for any element type. For that you need to go to view, flex tables, here are the tables shared. Right click on it, say new, flex table. Select the desired element type here and add fields of your interest. Click OK. Now this shared flex table has got created. This shared flex table is stored in the .xml file at this location. Please note down this location. You can copy this flex table .xml file and send it to your colleagues or put on the network. Please note that the other person need to copy this .xml file at the same location as shown over here. These shared flex tables are useful when you want to have specific fields in the flex tables and you want others to follow the same format as well, which will help you in creating reports in the standard format. Next feature is very interesting and I am sure you will like it. How about if you want to set a standard modeling format among your company, say standard presentation settings, color coding, standard engineering libraries, annotations, graph settings, project options, user data extensions, etc. Sounds cool, isn't it? There is one feature called SID files. The SID files can store all the standard information in one file which you can use as a standard template while starting a new project. This file has .sews extension. In this model, I have set up the presentation settings like color codings, annotations. I have set up my own engineering libraries for pump definitions, patterns and for the conduit catalogs, which I want to use as standard information for my new models. And also I have set up my options like default colors over here, drawing settings, units that I want to use in every model and also this labeling information. When you are creating a set file from an existing model, you need to make sure that you are relabeling this element numbers to 1. Click OK. Now, in order to create a set file, I need to delete these elements from the model so that only uh, presentation settings will get saved in the set file and not this model elements. I will delete the model. I will save it. Go to File, Seed and Save to Seed. I need to save this file. I will create a new model from that SID file by using it as a standard format for modeling. SID, new from SID. I will select the SID model file. As you can see it over here, my presentation settings like color codings, annotations, engineering libraries that I had created like pump definitions, patterns and also same thing about the tools, options, my default colors 
my drawing settings, units and labeling information everything is saved click OK you can use this sheet file as a standard template while creating new models and also you can share this sheet file among the other users to set up a standard modeling format for your company. Thanks.